Welcome to the T4 Show. My name is Colm, and today I'm here with Jeff from Turtle Beach, and we're here to talk some headsets. Jeff, how are you doing today? I'm well. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm enjoying and finally here, my favorite headset maker, Turtle Beach. And we asked you about um, looking at a headset that we can use on our consoles, Xbox, PS3. Yep. You suggested the XP400s. The XP400 is a pretty sweet headset. Uh, it... it plays noise and you can talk into it. It does all the things the headset's supposed to do. It's got a few more great features as well. The first thing I want to point out about this headset is that we're at PAX and uh, and this is a wireless headset and it's running on the show floor at PAX where your cell phone probably doesn't work. Correct. Okay, so so what this headset has is a new piece of technology that we've developed. It's called a dual band Wi-Fi radio. And the basic premise of this radio is that it operates anywhere between 2.4 and 5 gigahertz. It pays attention to the uh, Wi-Fi spectrum in the area. It, 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 it's smart. It's really smart. It sounds so, incredibly smart. So it pays attention to the Wi-Fi spectrum around it. It finds an open area, and it, and it establishes a connection in that open area. When you turn it off and on, it finds a new opening. So it's always going to find the optimal connection space, which is why we're able to have... We've got several of these headsets running in here. And then there's there's at least like a million nerds with a million cell phones in this place. So and, and I'm one of them. So and it's working fine. Um, so that's one of the really cool pieces of technology in this headset. It's also got a new surround sound processing in it that we've developed. This this new type of surround sound is really cool. So it's a five one surround. And basically the idea that we had is when you're in your house and you've got an actual surround sound system, you can move those speakers around. And if you move them around, it's going to sound different. And there's probably going to be a speaker setup that you think sounds better. Correct. So a headset is no different. Everybody's ears are different, and everybody hears surround sound differently. So the idea that we had is that you should be able to move the speakers around. So we have pre-programmed virtual speaker angles built into this headset, so you can get the speaker angle that's right for you. And is that just a button press of changing it? It is, in fact, just a button press. Let me find the button. Because I... I've used the PX5s, and I know I can set my different modes, and it goes one, two, is that sort of the same? That's exactly it. It's it's not a preset in the sense that it doesn't change, like, with a PX5, like, you can't boost footsteps or something like that. But you just go through the, the uh, different speaker presets, and it cycles through. You find the one that sounds best to your ears, and you set it and forget it. And I was losing my mind. I'm sorry. This, the button's on the transmitter. Oh, gotcha. So this is the transmitter. It's really small. It stays out of the way. It's got a few buttons on the side of it to take care of uh, some crucial factors like the speaker angle changes. Um, so this takes an optical input, so you do get full surround sound, um, really clean sound, runs on USB power, uh, which brings me to the next thing, what this guy runs on. This runs on a rechargeable battery that's built in. First of all, I had to buy AAA rechargeables for mine, which... I have to say, it, it does a good job. Like, I could go a couple weeks with it, go, by, but I feel like I wish it had a rechargeable built in. It's just, I just plug it in and it's charged. Well, now it does. So, of course. But hold on, it gets better. I'm not done, right. but wait, there's more. So you can actually plug in this rechargeable battery right here, and you can charge it while you're playing. So you actually never have to stop. So a lot of other headset companies, they make a rechargeable battery too, and they're like, Check it out. It lasts for four hours. You can play for four hours, and you've got to take the headset off, and you put it on the stand, and it can charge for eight hours, and you get four more. But we think that sucks, and that's it's awful. Roll. So our battery lasts about 18 hours, and you can charge it while you're playing. And uh, if you charge it right, this battery is going to last you for years. It has, it has thousands of charge cycles. It's an amazing battery. Um, and like I said, you know, 15 to 18 hours. This also has a Bluetooth in it, so you get wireless chat over Xbox, same as the PX5. You can take phone calls. I love that about it. I'll be playing a game, my wife calls, and I'm like, yeah, okay, all right. What are you doing? I'm doing the dishes. What are you doing? I love that. That's That's one of my favorite features. It is. It is is Um, the boyfriend get out of jail free, husband get out of jail free card. Here's another question that I don't know. The software is only PC. Yes. Is it still that way? Uh, This doesn't use any software at all. It has buttons. Really? It has buttons on a headset, and you push them, and it does things. So is that the direction that we were not going to have software? or? Well, this one doesn't have programmable presets. This is not a replacement for the PX5. It is. So the PX5 and XP500 are still our top of the line. It's just an older development cycle. So they've been out for about a year. Right. This is a brand new headset. We were actually sold out of these here at the show, but yesterday was the first time that anybody in the world could buy these. So it's, what are they retailing for? They're two twenty retail, but we've got them here for uh, for twenty percent off. What well, we had, but we don't. Um, 
So when will these be available in stores? Very, very soon. They should be out there. Uh, well, depending on the store, uh, hopefully within a month or so. Uh, we should have them on our site at turtlebeach.com much sooner than that. Right. So I won't need the, also the little dongle on my Xbox controller to... No, you get the, the dongle is for Xbox. So the Xbox doesn't actually support Bluetooth. So does it come with it? Or comes it? with it. Right, it's I got everything you need. It. No, it's, it's got it. Great. Um, and then it'll also, because it has a Bluetooth, you can get wireless chat over PlayStation Network as well. All right. Hey, Jeff, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Check yeah. these out. They are the XP400s from Turtle Beach.